Well, a warm welcome, one and all, on what has been a horrendous, a wet, wet evening. Thankfully, this rain has been deemed to be within reasonable limits. And after an inspection and all the regular formalities, the teams were handed in on time and the all-important go-ahead was given. Bit of disruption, of course, for those travelling in the direction of the ground. The crowds have taken a little longer than usual to get in and to settle down. But thankfully, that is behind us and we are on track. This place, simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. Keeps everyone guessing. Up to meet it. He scored! There is the breakthrough. Just so calm under pressure. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked a scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, that. Dinamo Zagreb, go ahead, one goal to the good. Played in with accuracy. Just brushed off the ball there. Being played forward, cuts it out. Dinamo Zagreb seem happy to let their strikers roam out wide. I wouldn't want that. No? No, well, my worry is that their, their main threat is being shifted out of contention. Oh, good interception. Good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Lovely bit of skill. Out to the right. A chance to play it in. Drilled in low. Forward pass. Hoists it forward. Well positioned to make that interception. That is terrific skill. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. And it's played forward. Solgado gets into a dangerous position. Referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. And here we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. So, 45 minutes to turn it round. 
forward it goes. Dinamo Zagreb have it back and they can go again. Played towards the front men. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Kuibashi, Kuibashi plays it forward. Katerine tries to get it forward quickly. It's a loose ball. Tries to locate someone up front. Dinks one in. Uh, the ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Hoists it forward. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, the stats are pretty telling here. It's hard to argue with the scoreline when you carry so little threat. And he's been booked for simulation. Correctly so, Peter, it's an element of the game we just can do without. Katerine gets it back. That is an adventurous run down the left-hand side. Hit into the middle. And he's there to clear it. Knocks it away. And it's been taken straight back. Out towards the flank. Pumps it into the area. And that's been levered clear. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Up towards the front line. Well played, he saw that coming. Lovely feet. And the finish! Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. It's a fine run and he's happy to keep going. Battles to win it back. So that's it, it is...